Here's our 2019 Ford F550. I'm just going to start out here by showing you that the engine's running just fine. I don't want to leave it run very long here because obviously I don't know if it's, I don't believe it's holding any coolant or anything. But just wanted to show you the oil pressure. Uh, of course, you can't see the miles, but the miles on it's 102 something. I apologize, I do not have anything else, but now I'm going to go ahead and shut her off. I do have a key for it, of course. So obviously, as you can see, we got damage here on this side. The axle is bent back here underneath the vehicle. The frame itself looks like it might be okay with the exception of that cab mount and you know, whatever else you got. Maybe there is a little bend there, I don't know. We have the rear axle kind of chained forward so that way the rear axle won't slide back. Obviously this toolbox here, service party, body part is uh, bent. We have the rear axle here, the two toolboxes, and of course the ladder rack up here is all good. This part of the service body is fine. The rear part, you've got the hydraulic stabilizers in the rear, storage back here in the rear. Tailgate, we've been using it as a little bit of scrap here, um, holding stuff. But here's the crane. That's probably the most expensive part on the truck. Of course, the engine's fine. This toolbox side here appears to be fine. So maybe you can get just the other side box and just use just the service body. Maybe you need the motor, maybe you need the transmission, maybe you need a rear axle. Hundred and I believe it was 102,000 miles on this truck. I'm gonna go ahead and disconnect our power so it stops dinging at us. I believe, don't hold me to it, yes, this is the 6.8 liter V10 engine. Got another toolbox up here in the front. This does have a transmission mounted PTO, I believe. It's a PSC 6025. Again, you get the whole truck, everything. I don't know if you're gonna get this exhaust or not. That's probably not gonna be the case. All the other little bits and pieces in here you get, of course. You'll have to look up if you want to know what gear ratio the rear axle is or any specific specs like that. You're going to have to look that up on your own. The VIN number for the truck here. Here's the wind or door stickers. The VIN number is on here. Right there is the VIN number. And that's going to conclude our video for today.
This is obviously it's a uh, two-wheel drive truck. Of course, the suspension here is knocked out. We do have a wheel loader to pick this truck up and load it on a trailer for you if you need be. Again, any questions, please email us. Do not call us. We're never in our office. We're always out moving vehicles, picking vehicles up, meeting with customers, running to shops, picking up parts, and so on and so on. So please email us if you have any questions. And that is all. Thank you very much and have a good day.